ओके लेट स्टार्ट विद सिंपल क्वेश्चन हाउ ऑफन डू यू फील दैट योर मैसेज जस्ट इज इंट रीचिंग योर ऑडियंस You put out a great blog post, announce an exciting offer, or share something important, but somehow it gets buried under loads and loads of emails or lost in the endless social media scroll. Frustrating, right? Well, that's where push notifications comes in. Push notifications are a smart way to grab your audience's attention exactly when it matters. These messages appear instantly on users' device, delivering updates without any delay. So, whether you are announcing a limited time deal, sharing a big update or posting fresh content, push notifications will make sure that your audience always stays in the loop. And yes, if you ask me, they're not just a medium to inform, but they also create an opportunity to engage right when your audience is mostly active, making them an essential tool for real-time communication. Therefore, in today's video we will go step by step on how to set up push notifications onto your WordPress site. Yes, installing the plugin to deploying it onto your site, I'll guide you through it all. And trust me, by the end of this video, you will have a powerful tool to keep your audience informed and connected in real time. So, grab your coffee, get comfortable and let's dive into this tutorial as it's time to take your website to the next level and keep your visitors coming back for more. All right. Now that you know why push notifications are a game changer, let's jump straight into setting them up onto your WordPress site. For your information, let me tell you initially that there are several plugins available in the market to do this job, such as Push Engage, Push Crew, and Web Pusher. However, for this project, we will be using the widely popular OneSignal plugin, which is renowned for its ease of use, seamless integration, and powerful features. So, let's get into my system and quickly get started. Firstly, we are going to install and activate the plugin. For it, start by logging into your WordPress dashboard. Here, go to Plugins, Add New, and search for One Signal Push Notifications. Once you find it, click on Install Now, and then Activate. After activating, you will see a new menu item called One Signal Push in the sidebar. Simply go ahead and click on it. Inside the plugin settings, now you will find a link that says Create a One Signal account or login. Click on One Signal, and then it will redirect you to the One Signal official website. On the website, here on clicking Get Started Now, we gotta fill in details like email address and password to sign up. I'm simply using my social for it, so no hassle. Now, after you have signed up as well, let's select the free plan here to get started. That's it. The moment you will do that, you will be guided through a quick onboarding process. Answer a few questions here about your role, your industry, and how you are planning to use One Signal. For example, here you might select options like driving website traffic, uh, sending updates, or re-engaging users. Once all this is completed, click on Continue. All right, we are here on the second step of the onboarding, where we have to give organization details. Now, I don't mind sharing that Posimith innovations. Next, enter the website's link here. We'll select e-commerce and retail from this drop-down, and choose a random range here, say 26 to 100. That's it. Click Continue. And now we have moved to the next step, that is create app. Here we just gotta put in the name of our app or website. For example, Tattoo Muse is my website's name, so I will put that in here and click create. After this, you will be directed to the One Signal dashboard. Here, you will find a quick start guide designed to help you set up your messaging channels efficiently. This guide ensures that every step is clear, making the setup process smooth and straightforward. So, let's move forward by clicking on push notifications. In the push settings, select the web option to configure push notifications for your site. Under web configuration here, we have to choose WordPress plugin or website builder as the integration method. Then, enter your site's name here, example Tattoo Muse, that is in my case. Also, we'll have to feed in my main site's URL. That's https colon forward slash forward slash tutorials dot com. Now, let me tell you that this is a very important process, so double check for accuracy here, as any errors in the site's name or URL could cause issues later during integration. Once everything is verified, simply go ahead and save your configuration. And that's done. Once saved, one signal will generate your app ID and API key, which is essential for linking your WordPress site to one signal in the next step. Saying that, our initial setup is done. Now, it's time to return to our WordPress dashboard, so let's do that quickly. Once back, simply go to the One Signal push settings, then open the configuration tab. Next, you have to copy your app ID and API keys from the One Signal website and paste them into their respective fields to connect your WordPress site here. Now, 
Now, let's head over to the prompt section in the plugin settings by scrolling down. And from here, as you can see, you can control and customize how your visitors will subscribe to notifications. Please note that these settings are super crucial and gives you the ability to take maximum control. However, for now we will keep everything at default settings. But I highly encourage you to experiment and tailor these options to make the most out of these plugin. Moving further, finally it's time to test our setup. For that, we have to visit our site as a regular user to see if the subscription prompt appears correctly by entering the website in a private mode. And that's done. It's working perfectly. And there you have it. In just a few steps, you've set up push notifications that are ready to keep your audience informed in real time. They will be quick, direct and incredibly effective at keeping your audience engaged. Now, if you have any questions or tips about push notifications, drop them in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you. Also, if you really enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to our channel with the bell icon turned on beside it so you never miss out on amazing videos like these. I will see you in the next one. Until then, keep learning and exploring.